Welcome to the Void Spark Chronicles, day 189. My name's Landon, you're watching RPG ABC, and we are playing this quest calendar every day this year and having a ton of fun with it. Um, previously, we are searching for Andy, and we got information from a messenger that Andy used to live near one of these areas in the jungle. We went there and got shot down by auto turrets. So we think that's where Andy was. And then um, we had to do like a gear puzzle thing to open the door. And then there's a, a Star Wars uh, probe droid uh, dude uh, <laughs> sitting behind the door. And uh, we killed it our first shot, but it just unloaded on us while it was malfunctioning and everything. And then that brings us to today, which is... Tuesday, August 8th, 2023. Dust stirs as you step into the warm, stale air of the abandoned bunker. You hope that you can find some answers here. So we start at X, and we go looking around. I only see one... Oh, there's two, a small little door. There's, there's five rooms, okay. Five, three, four... Five is right in front of us, so let's check out five. A ship the size of a large escape pod sits in this room. The ship features a logo of the Zorian Empire. Hangar doors overhead have been welded shut. Roll a d20 in intellect, reminder, engineering. Oh, I do have engineering. Um, so that is intellect plus one, engineering plus two. So we're at plus three here. 14 plus three. We're looking at 17. How are we doing? Uh, if the result is... 14 or more, you find some ship parts you can use from this old busted up ship. Okay. It says some ship parts, but it doesn't tell me how many. I'm going to write one ship part. That's interesting. Let's see. From five, we are going to... Oh, room one was technically closer to the door. So let's go back to room one. A large living area normally meant for gathering and relaxation doubles as a library. There are shelves with thousands of books in this room. Almost all of them are educational material. Uh, everything from basic math and language to advanced concepts of philosophy, triple in integrals, and string theory. Intellect. Student. I am not a student. So just a plus one here. That's a seven. If the result is 12 or less, uh, there are too many books to sort. Uh, to sort or go through. Yeah, I would agree. The scientists will probably go through those. This is just like the first initial clean sweep, right? Uh, let's go to room three, which is the workshop. Why am I rolling? I don't need to roll yet. This room is a large workshop with many machines, equipment, and supplies. All the equipment is heavy. You wonder how it was brought here. Uh, strength Investigator. Am I Investigator? No. I think that's my Dragon Staff uh, Maladoria character that's Investigator. So just Strength, which is plus one. Eleven plus one is twelve. Dang, we just barely miss it. If the result is 12 or less, there are too many books to sort through or go through. Yeah, we're, we're starting to get that, like, Andy's smart. Okay, let's go to room four. Four. This room looks like a makeshift kitchen area created from lab burners and heating coils. This couldn't have sustained the cooking needs of anyone. You rummage around and then you peer and when you peer into a provisional stove, you catch the scent of a heavy gas leak. Constitution danger sense. I do have danger sense, so that's plus two. And my constitution is plus one. Okay. 14 plus 3, 17 um, in the kitchen. I think I read the wrong thing for the last one. So first, the kitchen. The result of is 13 or more. You steal yourself against the effects of the fumes. Okay, we're good. Um, and I read the wrong thing before, and I believe the result I actually got was none of the equipment works. There is no power source for the workshop. Okay. 
And so room two is our last one. There is yet another heavy locked door that must lead to something important. You may continue to search through the bunker and return here when you are done. So we are done. We've gone through every room. Uh, we got one ship part, I think. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how many we got. It didn't say. Uh, let me know how many you're taking due to that error. <laughs> Uh, anyways, this was interesting. Get a little glimpse of Andy's life before uh, meeting someone, having a kid, going to another world, all of that jazz, right? Uh, very interesting stuff here. So let's move on to tomorrow, right? We'll see you then. Thank you so much for watching. Come and like this video. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss tomorrow's video or any of the future adventures of the Quest Calendar. Be sure to check out the Dragonstaff of Maladoria monthly uh, campaign I'm doing, and this Sunday, The Wolves of Langston, chapter one, or it might be the whole freaking thing. I can't wait to find out. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and of course, until next time, gotta make sure my pointer is on, stop recording, uh, keep rolling dice.